Hello and welcome to Farming Simulator 19 and this let's play on um, County Line where we're growing cotton. Um, so I'm, I, I'm still sowing field 11, it's gigantic. I'm getting closer to the end but it's gigantic as I said, really really big. So um, the cool thing I got is I got that little thing over there. Um, not little at all actually it's quite big I got a seed tender it's a Peterbilt um, you can find a link in the description as always uh, it's pretty cool uh, it holds like 35,000 liters of seed so or fertilizer if you want that in it so it was 75 grand not too bad uh, I could definitely I think that's okay and the fun part is I can actually back it up while the cedar is planting and fill it, refill it. So we're gonna refill these and we're gonna go refill the cedar, this tender. It's cool, actually it looks, it's 10,000 liters left but it doesn't look, look like it's a lot more. <coughs> but cool, I like a uh, really cool one definitely a keeper and it <laughs> does make this so much easier the interesting part is I, I, it's getting to I used like 25,000 liters so far for this field and then we used some some before this so I don't know this is like a 40,000 liter field maybe if we can find the other one <coughs> you probably wouldn't I don't know if you could drive around a field like this it would have been a very nicely cultivated field to be able to drive around with this one without getting too much compaction uh, where's the other where's the tractor oh it's over here somewhere I just have the lowest setting set so I can see it So if we just park here. We're gonna go and refill this. That's my plan. Soon. This is a gigantic field. It's so big. It's it's just so freakingly big. This field. It's pretty amazing. Um. Oh come on. How slow can you go? Since the plant is quite slow, it's not an issue. I can just go over. So that's full. We'll go and do it like this. And pull that in. The rear view mirrors are quite crappy though. Ah, eh, never mind. Just need this to see, get seed in, into our field. Uh, some, um, I sold off my pickup truck and my other seed tender. I got, ooh, well, I didn't give 75 for it, but uh, with the money I had saved and with selling that off, I got had like 72 grand in the bank. Uh, I borrowed some more money because this was 75 and then I bought it, so lost a little bit of money but f not too much uh, because I sold the, the pickup since we have two pickups I didn't need two I think so I was, I was happy about selling that so you fill it up sort of like anything else a lot of other stuff in game you just drive up to where you want to fill it up and fill it up So I'm thinking we need more seed because I use so much seed just on 
the first field number 11 and that's a big one 29 is also a very big one the other ones are kind of small so i don't think that's a big issue but i'm not sure we'll we'll see how much <laughs> stuff we need to more seed we need to buy but i'm thinking we probably need to buy some more seed The, these ones I have a couple of pallets here too I can grab so I'm thinking we'll probably need to invest some more money to be able to get the next harvest going oh, sorry. Um, but that's okay uh, I think our credit with the bank is okay These actually exist in real life. There are actually semi versions, and I, I haven't seen one of those. But if you Google Meridian Tender, you can find some pretty awesome pictures and videos of of these sea tenders, and uh, they are gigantic. But if you have a gigantic farm with with gigantic aerials, I'm guessing that gigantic sea tender is probably right up your alley, or that's a weird usage of right up your alley. That's not what I meant. Um, it's probably what you need. And this is a pretty big farm, so we definitely need it here. And we're going to use it. <coughs> Get this rolling. Does take a bit of time to fill it up, but if I have to lift all of these bags manually, that would be terribly. I guess we would have an auger probably in real life, to which you would fill it up from. Mm, but here we we cheat a little bit. Do something with our virtual farm hands. Okay, so that's full. Take this over to our next field. So I'm thinking we'll do 11 and 29, the biggest ones first, uh, just for the heck of it, and see how it works. Uh, it's kind of interesting to do the big ones first. They take some time to do, but it definitely looks really cool when you've done it really really cool I think uh, so we're also gonna go and think we'll start fertilizing this field because as soon as that's done there we could fertilize it um, I think well we have one that's a one pass there probably and one pass back there so we're getting close to finish it so we can actually go and fertilize it actually, I think you have to go over in for some reason it, it's un no it didn't unhook no it did unhook the video oh. last time I played this it, it unhooked the PDO for some reason and everything else on the trailer but now it seems to be hooked up so that's good I guess and this I feel uh, last time I fertilized this field fill this up with fertilizer and <laughs> I had to refill it again so that's how big the field is even though the this one can easily fertilize field number 29 without any issues um, I have like 6,000 left or something five six thousand left maybe four or so, something like that it cannot be fertilized this field because it's so humongous okay so uh, that's fertilizing field 11 That's where we start. What did you, we can drive this manually if we would like to enjoy that. We'll just let the hide worker do its thing. So, fertilizing. 
level two. We should check, just check out so it works. Yes, it does. Is there a in there? Yes, it's, it's a big field. It's a really big field. So cotton, white color in, on the map here. When this is done, we'll go and do this one. And then we'll go probably do 25 and then 14. Or maybe four, or maybe I'll split, well maybe I'll do 29 with two of them and then we'll just use the ordinary one on each of these fields. I'll think about it, I haven't decided. They, because it, it looks so small, it's like, oh you, can, you, don't, you can't fit two on there, on those two fields, but they are actually quite big too, so. What else? What next field by 24 is pretty nice size field. This is not much field. 15 is nice. We should buy 15. 16 is also nice. 30, 30 is a fairly big field. 31 is a fairly big field too. 9 is a very big field. So 10. 10 is a good field too. Maybe we should go for 10 next time. We'll see. Uh, I'm thinking if you made like 2.3 million every, on a good day on the last of those three fields we owned before, then we're gonna make a lot of money with this field too. <coughs> I'm thinking, I'm guessing. Oh, there's actually a little bit left there anyway. I think this. Probably the one that takes that little bit there. Oh, we'll see. Maybe I need to refill this anyway. I thought I wouldn't have to refill it, but maybe we do. My cotton field is like 100 kilometers per hour on the field. Ah, uh, it's not probably very realistic at all. Good thing I can back it up to this and catch it. get the fifth wheel, not the fifth wheel, the last wheel pair down back there because it's full and it's not down, I don't know, that's setting. Uh. It's almost done! The number 11 is almost done. It's just that little bit, bit there left. That's done. Could bring that back home to over here. I should probably go like 2014 in the next field. You look at where. Ah, never mind. There is that one. Is that that one? Yes it is. Okay, so that was one. Stop driver. I just came back from the store with my son and uh, we, we bought some milk and stuff and we bought some like an instant soup thingy or instant bolognese pasta dish. It's like, I bought two, I paid for two, but I only bought one from the store. It's like, crap. So he got, my son got it and I was so 
I was very pissed at myself mostly. He was like, are you mad at me, Dad? No, I'm mad at myself because I didn't check that I had two. I scanned two. I put one in the bag, probably. Never realized I didn't just put one and then walked around the store and bought all the stuff we needed. So I, 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 ate, a I ate a sandwich, so I'm okay. But feel stupid. Of course. If I had three, ten, three of these, the, this would go so fast. Well, well, two is more than enough for pretty much any farm. <laughs> you have to have a really big farm to have more than three cedars, I guess. At least this size cedar. This is so freaking big. Okay, so let's see. Field twenty nine. This is the size it says it is. We'll go with that. Doesn't matter. Current vehicle will go two headlands. We'll have two vehicles. We'll generate course. So this is a little smaller field than the other one, so it should go a little bit faster. Um Obviously it won't go that fast because it's really still a humongous field. Hoping it will go a little bit faster. We would need some sort of field uh, maintenance track. That would be good. So we can maintenance, um, do maintenance on uh, the cotton harvested mostly in the field. It's, it's, so we wouldn't have to bring them back to do the uh, stuff there. Okay, so here we are. We'll go. Uh, let's see. Go left with that one. Nearest waypoint. And drive course. Good. Okay, so we'll save this. This will be. X to field twenty nine. Okay. okay, so that's doing its thing, and that's doing its thing. It's big, <laughs> such a big field. <laughs> it's so ridiculous, a big. I think the Rogate has like a 36 meter of a span when it comes to fertilizing. Maybe that's better. So here we are. I think this is pretty much done, I'm guessing. Yes. Well, there's a little bit there, but we don't want to. I'm not going to go back the entire way there to to get that one. Let's pull this and we'll go to the next field, number 29. We can actually load that course, so that's done. X2, field 29. And we'll head over there. Compared to the plowing, plowing takes a lot of it wears the, the tractor a lot and it takes a lot of fuel. Compared to that, uh, seeding takes a little less fuel than a lot less fuel and a lot less um, wear and tear on the tractor. So I think a pretty cool thing implemented that some depending on what you do, you do will have to spend more money maintaining main maintaining your vehicle stock. Which I think is pretty awesome. Such a gigantic field. <laughs> so just, it's just so big, it's like ridiculously big.
So let's see. Let's just make sure this is exactly right. Yes, it is. Here we'll go and engage this so it doesn't stick to this one. We want to stick this one. Oh, worked out like a charm. Yay! Wait, uh, this line actually gives a shadow. <laughs> I think that's a little bit odd. Leaves a little bit, but not too much actually. That's a good corner to to keep it all out, or to get everything covered with with seed. I think. So I guess this is doing its thing. This field is done with seeding and now it's fertilizing and this field is getting seeded. I mean, oh, they are so big these seeders. They're just so incredibly incredibly big. We'd like to do arables. Maybe I should do that after the next session of cotton. That one, I think I don't know about the corner. Maybe this corner is too hard for it to do. Maybe I should do this manually. Yeah, mm, yeah I have to fix this manually. Misses quite a lot there, which is fair because I have to get around that corner, but it's a bit too much for my taste in a way. Just pack this into the corner and we'll, we'll see this. Too, because I think it, it harvests uh, actually pretty much out to the corner because the harvest is not very wide, so harvesting this is not an issue when it comes to just getting out to the corner. Well, a little bit maybe, but not too much. Let's go with that. Do that. This is also a humongously big field. It's very, very big. Yeah, but that's the way it is. If you need something with a lot of. Well, let's try this one. I think this is a cool truck. I don't know. A little weird. Only big. Uh, and you wouldn't refill it like this in real life, I guess. You would stop, go out to the edge, and where the truck would be waiting. So this is uh, very unrealistic. this and we'll drive around to the other side of the field where we can meet them up and fill them up. I wonder how much money we can make in the, of this next harvest. Hopefully a lot. I don't I don't know what to do with all of the money. Maybe I should just invest like in maybe I should switch from cotton to something else. That's possible, plausible. Um, I don't need to switch that much. Oh, I guess I need a, a harvester and well, I need to switch to harvesters basically. 
but the seeder can seed stuff. I can go for corn. If you look at the like the corn here is here. Um, no, sorry. Back. If you go for corn, I mean, this one is the widest one. It's 12 meters. That's pretty wide. And you could go for the biggest harvesters are these ones. Either the New Holland Revolution or the Ideal, which could be. You could go Aiko, Fent, Fenko, Massey, or Fent. Oh, those are two. This is a really big harvester also. Pretty cool. I like this. This is a cool harvester. This is also a pretty cool harvester. This holds, let's see, um, 14, 15. This is 17,000 liters. So pretty cool. I wonder if I can set up bushels. This I think you can change it to traffic health window, health icons, colorblind of dollar, kilometers, hectares, acres, hectares. It's acres. Interactive radio range is a domain. I don't know. Well, I thought it was also a way to switch. Let me try that one. Miles per hour. So to play an American map, I guess I should have it on miles per hour, of course. Okay, so this is the field we're gonna go for now, and this is doing it's fertilizing. We we'll need to refill that eventually. Actually, we do. That's one thing we could do. We could go and buy a fertilizer because we need some more fertilizer. Get this one here. Send this on its way. Uh, main farm to shop. There you go. Go and grab some fertilizer. We need to borrow some money to do that. That's okay. We need fertilizer. That's the way it is. Okay, so um, I'm gonna stop there, I think. Um, thank you for watching. I'm Andy. If you liked this episode, please hit the like button, leave a comment, share. If you like this channel, please subscribe. And we'll see what we'll do next time. Have a great day, everyone. Take care. Bye bye.